Due to COVID-19, the tourism industry has been on hold. Closed borders, negative travel advice and no income to a large group of people shows us how many people are actually dependent on tourism. In this video, we'll discuss seven key elements to consider when developing new tourism experiences. The recession of tourism has shown us how quickly nature flourished due to the absence of tourists. Wildlife moved back into urban areas and the Himalayas were visible again after 30 years. On the other hand, we've also seen how wildlife conservation was threatened due to the absence of tourism. It shows us tourism has a unique position to create benefits and positive impact for nature and local people. And although the industry has been on hold, the urge to travel and discover the world is stronger than ever. So, how can you develop new tourism experiences that meet the current needs of your customers while being good for the planet and people? Let's dive into our seven key elements to develop new tourism experiences post-COVID-19. Number one, off the beaten track. Develop tourism experiences that take travelers off the beaten track into the unknown. Escape touristic highlights and show them hidden gems, discover less visited places and spread tourism impact. Going off the beaten track avoids crowded areas and offers a better experience. Number two, slow travel. Let travelers enjoy the destination at a slower pace than they're used to. Take the entire trip into consideration. And almost every destination has beautiful scenic routes that will add value to the experience. Take the train or bike for a change. Number three, less frequent but longer travel. When traveling off the beaten track and at a slower pace, travelers simply need more time to explore the destination. Take it slow and focus on authentic interaction with locals and a deeper connection with the destination. It will also mean less flights and a lower carbon footprint. Number four, local travel. Besides targeting international tourists, start developing tourism experiences that are also interesting for local people. Tailor your experiences to a new audience. Show locals a different side of their own surroundings and let them rediscover. Number five, good travel. Be the change and focus on good travel and let travelers experience the destination properly. Support local communities and learn about their culture, food, language and history and focus on animal welfare, nature conservation to create a positive impact. Number six, self-guided travel. Travelers will more and more choose to travel in small groups with family and friends and they are also more likely to choose self-drive and self-guided experiences as they can socially distance themselves. Include smaller hotels and lodges and stay away from crowds. Work with online itineraries and travel tips. Number seven, personal and flexible service. Embrace strict health and safety protocols and show your customers you care about them. Be prepared for last minute bookings and offer flexible cancellation conditions that build trust with your customers. Their health is priority number one and people will only book a trip if they feel safe. Despite this being a very difficult time for the tourism industry, take the opportunity to see the positive side of things. Invest in your business and find inspiration to develop good tourism experiences for the future. Use this time as a rare chance to think about how we travel. Decide for yourself how you would like to become a better tour operator.